Today we're vlogging. Basically, this morning I have been literally working all day because we've been running around for the last couple days just trying to get everything to make the apartment more cozy and homey. Like we literally just got this artwork. I'll show you guys some of the new stuff that we picked up, but right now we're gonna run over to Best Buy. There's a new vlog camera out and I'm gonna make an upgrade. So <laughs> let's go. This morning I've been literally working all morning. So I was actually excited to come and check out Best Buy. And actually I got some more work I gotta do once we get back in the house. But I was just excited to come check out this camera because I'm getting better with vlogging. Like I'm actually, it's not like second nature for me and I really want it to be. And one of my pet peeves about this vlog camera that I use now, I feel like the lens is not wide enough. Like right now I do have you guys on the tripod so it's giving more of like my surroundings. But otherwise, it's very like focused and it's super close to my face. And I've tried getting the other lenses. It's just, first of all, it's too heavy for the camera. It's big, it's bulky, and it just, I just don't like it. And it adds weight to my tripod. So anyway, I'm excited to check out this camera. So before I tell you about my new Sony ZV-1 Mark II, I wanna say a huge thanks to Best Buy for sponsoring this video. They kindly gifted me this camera and I've been loving it, you guys. So first of all, this camera's super lightweight. I noticed that right off the bat. As soon as you pick it up, it's incredibly lightweight. Like I love that so I don't feel like I'm lugging a big old camera around. And I also noticed that this has a skin smoothing feature. It really just smooths you out. It has three different settings. So you can put it on like low, medium, high or you can turn it off altogether. And that's really nice for those days where you're vlogging and you're not wearing makeup and you're just not feeling your best and you just want a little something. <laughs> so I really like that. But what I love the most so far is this wide angle lens. Now previously I would have to hold my camera far out with my hand and like hope for the best or carry around my tripod. And honestly, most of the time my bag is too small to carry my tripod. So it just didn't work out for me and I was like super close. And even now, I'm not, my arm is not even fully extended and I'm still getting so much of everything around me in my shot, which is what I love. You guys, I've really been obsessed with mushrooms lately. Anyway, we'll talk more about that another time, but for now, I'm actually about to run out and get new flowers for all the arrangements in my apartment. These were so beautiful. If they have these again, I'm gonna get them, but I might just get a different color. And if you noticed, I'm filming behind the camera. And what's great about this Sony ZV-1 Mark II is that it switches the microphone to pick up the audio from wherever my voice is. There's no face in front of it, so it detects that I'm standing behind and it flips the microphone. So that's really great. My voice is nice and clear and you guys can hear everything I'm saying really well. Now let's go get some new flowers for this flower pot. Well, actually, before we go, Wiss is gonna make us some smoothies. No, just cut, just cut. <laughs> Yo, cut, cut, cut. <laughs> So now we're in the car headed to go pick up the flowers and I usually don't film while the car is moving because it's just so bumpy but this camera the Sony ZV-1 Mark II has some really great stabilization so now I don't have to worry about that. The living room looks so beautiful. I just wanted to show you guys like how it looks in the evening because we just got 
the lights back there that are lighting up the plant we just got those they look so beautiful especially when it's dark and i turn off all like the main lights and those are the only ones on so beautiful and i'm not the only one who keeps the tags on furniture pieces like until you like literally make up your mind i mean i'm positive they're staying but i just feel like i need to leave the tags on a little bit longer <laughs> but i love the living room so far i'm gonna do like an official um living area tour because we have this area and then my sitting area so you guys will see where everything's from and all that but so far so good i love it Okay, so finally finished with all the arrangements. I don't know how I feel about them. The one in the kitchen, the white roses, it looks really pretty, but I feel like I could have used a little bit more of the white roses. This one was just a straight up experiment. I like the way it came out, but um, it's, it's looking like just like wildflowers. We picked those. <laughs> it looks like we picked those. And then the flowers in the living room, I think they, those look really cute, nice and simple, you know? So anyway, it doesn't need to be perfect. When I look at the flowers, they just make me happy. So I just keep playing around and I get better every time I do it, I think. So that's fun. But yeah, that took a lot out of me. I'm super tired now. But I do have more work to do on the computer. So I'm actually going to jump on the computer and do some planning for tomorrow. And then I'll catch up with you guys then. Good morning, you guys. Today's a new day. I'm up early and I'm actually running out the door, but I just wanted to talk about my hair for a second and show you guys my outfit, of course. Okay, so overall, not bad for my first shot. Now, this doesn't get hot enough, I don't think, even though it felt like it was hot, but there's no temperature setting. Like, there's no way for me to know the dial only goes from high to low, so I'm just guesstimating. I put it all the way up on high, and I don't know. I just don't like it. I'd rather get one that has a digital um, temperature so I can actually know how much heat I'm putting on my hair and I'm not guessing so I'm gonna um, exchange this one out but overall it did give me a beachy wave just like I said it would now I think that I should have flat ironed my hair before I went in with the waver just to get it a little bit more smooth and a little bit less frizz but it looks like a beachy wave so we'll see overall not bad for my first shot I'm gonna try it again but I think it looks good for now this beachy style is my new this is my new style like this is gonna be the style that's like go to in between salon visits i'm so obsessed with it i'll show you guys more in the sunlight because it's kind of gloomy right now and i'm in the house but this is my hairstyle like it was so easy like literally all i did was take off my bonnet this morning shake my hair around and put this part behind my hair <laughs> hair prep time was zero today so i'm really obsessed with this hairstyle but let me show you what i'm wearing I told you guys once before in like an update video that Winston and I wanted to get into commercial real estate spaces. And so that's what we've been doing. So that's what we're on our way to. We're in, on our way to a meeting now and we're going to meet someone and discuss a possible space um, for like an office and a podcast studio. And we just have a few different things in mind. So we're headed there now and hopefully we like this space because we've seen a few spaces that were like... You know how you gotta kiss a lot of frogs before you could get to what you're looking for. So we'll see. Portfolio with a group called Circle Industria. Um, they Maybe. have a pretty big monopoly on this corner. Um, we put uh, one of the younger guys in charge of leasing their portfolio. So is that Kyle? Um, uh, no, Kyle is he's one of the he's one of the seniors on the team. Um, we brought on a new guy. His name is Brian. Okay. Um, he, we put him in charge of that. It's his first kind of dive into commercial. Now, do you know, so you see how, like, there's a larger room back here? Mm -hmm. Do you know if any of these spaces have the larger room so that you walk in? No. None of them have warehouse immediately. Um, they're all going to be in the back, kind of, kind of the way this is set up. Is this very well? This is not. I have been loving my Sony ZV-1 Mark II. I've been having a really fun time just like playing around, testing out the new features and just getting to know this camera and I really love it. That wide angle alone is enough for me to convert. As soon as I turned the camera on and started shooting with it and I was do you know, recording myself as I was talking, I just really loved how much of the background the camera was also getting and of course I can adjust that with zoom zooming in and you know zooming out as I need to so I really really love that that's my favorite feature overall um I do really like the skin softening as well that feature is really nice because it helps in the editing process so if you're just getting started if this is something new to you it does help in the editing process because you don't have to worry about like color correcting and all that it just looks really good right away so all you have to really focus in on is just you know editing down the footage condensing it or doing anything like that that you would need to do but i really love how compact and versatile this camera is literally turn it on and start shooting you're good to go the monitor is really great to have that indicator that border the red border around um the screen while the camera is actually shooting is really great because just to like let you know when you're recording while you're recording is a huge deal because 
Like I said, I cannot tell you the amount of times I had been recording things and didn't realize that I wasn't recording. So that indicator is really, really great. Overall, this is just a really great camera to make an upgrade to or just to get started with in general. If you're shooting from your phone and you feel like you want to you know, make that next step, this is the camera to get. I really like this. And make sure you guys check the description box to be able to pick up this camera from Best Buy. As, as a matter of fact, as soon as I finish recording this video, I'm gonna hop on bestbuy.com because I need a new charging port. So I'm gonna get that. But overall, make sure you guys check the description box so you can pick up your new Sony ZV-1 Mark II. Huge thanks to Best Buy for sponsoring this video. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you wanna catch me out on some of my other platforms like Instagram, Pinterest, all those places, then make sure you check the description box for links and information on where else you can find me. And make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't already. Ready, stay tuned for fashion content is coming up I've already started my full fashion shopping so we will be doing shopping with me vlogs on my new Sony ZV-1 Mark II and I'm just gonna take you guys with me on my full fashion journey so I'm just so excited I've been finding such cute pieces that I cannot wait to share with you so stay tuned for that and I'll catch you guys in the next video hey guys welcome back to a new vlog my name is Ashley Park this is Park Avenue and I have lots of fashion content so make sure you subscribe and hit those notification bells so you don't miss a thing so we're starting off a new vlog today and i cannot wait to show you guys what i have been shopping for i have new fall fashion that i'm so excited about so let me show you what i picked up recently 